In today's news, Oscar and Dana going at it. Oscar also signs Miguel Cotto to a multi-fight deal. And Kathy Duva more than comfortable with three U.S. judges. Hey everybody, I'm Jason Abelson with your Boxcaster News. After issuing a public plea for people not to buy the forthcoming, seemingly, Mayweather Conor McGregor fight. Oscar De La Hoya caught the ire of UFC President Dana White. Dana White saying, what the f Oscar? Wasn't Oscar the guy who proposed Canelo to fight McGregor? This wasn't lost on Dana White either. Basically saying, you want money grab fights all the time. Maybe you're just worried that Canelo Triple G might be affected by Mayweather McGregor. I think Dana White might be onto something. Oscar, you're nice enough, you're good enough, and doggone it, people like you, and your fight's gonna do well regardless. So get off Dana's back. Leave uh, Dana White alone, please. And Oscar was doing more than just beefing with Dana White yesterday. He was also taking care of business, including signing Miguel Cotto to a multi-fight deal that includes an August 26th showdown, an all-action showdown with Yoshihiro Kamigai at the StubHub Center and extends beyond that. Rumors have it December 2nd showdown. Also in the works with Juan Manuel Marquez. Oh, I love that fight. And you would think Sergey Kovalev's promoter, Kathy Duva, wouldn't be too happy the thought of another three American judges going over the rematch between her man Kovalev and Andre Ward after three American judges decided Ward had won the first fight, 114-113. Turns out Duva doesn't have a problem with it, saying she trusts the judgment of Nevada State Athletic Commission. Good on you, Kathy. I agree. Let's just hope the judges actually score the fight properly this time. Yeah, well, you know, that's just like uh, your opinion, man. For all the best boxing news and features anywhere on the web, you know where to come. Right here, the Boxcaster. And if you see my voice, can you return it to me, please?